Right, carrying on the walk, the last stages now of the walk. <sighs> Looks well pruned this bit, doesn't it? Must be rabbits. Or it could be the deer, because there are deer that associated with this old fox in the house, you know. I didn't see any last time I came either. I'm bit getting a bit worried about what's happening to them. To be quite honest. I mean, when you come to Holford, you, you hope to see the deer. It's like one of the attractions, if you like. Well, not an attraction, but they are beautiful. I mean, the last time I came, I, I seen one in somebody's garden. And um, the people that come on Bridgewater here and now who take photos of deer, they're not coming from Contox, they're taking them from Exmoor. So I don't know if they've all left. To see none at all, nothing. That is so unusual. I mean, deer quite often sit down in the heather and stuff like that, you know. It's a nice picture of the trees up there, isn't it? Yeah, it's a nice place to be remembered from, I think. <sighs> because sometimes going down hills worse than going up. You've got to use different muscles. And your shoe, your toes fall down inside your, your boots. And they sort of push against the bottom of the boot. It's quite painful. <sighs> I think we've done this. I think we've done very well. It's probably going to be... Up going on for half five now, I would have thought. What do you think? Let's have a look. One minute past five, not bad at all. I've got no idea where I'm coming out. It's supposed to be not far from the green. But then that could be a path over, maybe over there. This might come out near Fox and Ash, wouldn't it? I don't know. I don't know where it's coming out. Oh. Could be that it's not the path I'm thinking that goes up. That could be a different one. Yeah. It's nice exploring though, isn't it? I expect some people say, oh, go on, get a move on, Sheila. I'm actually going down a quite a steep slope. It's quite a steep slope. I'm going to turn off for a minute. All right, back on, just for this wood bit. Yeah, it looks like this is an alternative path, which I did know about. I didn't use this one. Normally, when we go to our fox, and we're on the lower path. This is all part of our fox and house, but I think this will still take us out near the green. But I've not done this before. No, I haven't. I've been on one further over, much further over. That's this will all be your fox and house in there. I remember taking George. Actually, we roamed through a lot of ferns once. Yeah, we roamed through a lot of ferns. Sun coming through there, look, at last. Old wood. Old trees. They know what's going on. See, every time I come out, I find somewhere different to explore, look. I've never been up here. I haven't been up here, no. I've known about the track coming down. I didn't know. I thought it was just going to be a narrow track. I was going to come out by the green. Behind this fence is all fox, isn't it? Or well, there are grounds. Look at this old wood. I love it. 
it, you know, it's a bit creepy, but I do love it. I do love it. It's a nice way to end the walk, isn't it? If you think about it, it's a nice way to end a walk. Ending on a... Look at all that going up through there. I can imagine the deer creeping about here as well. Of course, what you don't want, mate, is wild dogs. That have been let out. That would be a bit scary. You'd have to be get ready to climb up a sick old stump there, look. Look at that. That's a real old tree, isn't it? That's a real old tree. God, who would have known all this was here? Who would have known? It's like a cycle shed. Never said it was private, did it? Fancy that. This track, I've never known about it before. This is Sheila's Adventures on the 28th of August 2018. After five hours so far. Like just over five hours walking. I left home about 10 o'clock. Got stuck in a traffic jam for nearly two hours really. Got all the holidaymakers going home and all that sort of thing. And um... This is amazing, this, isn't it? It's a lovely walk, an alternative one. An alternative route. So I've been out for a beautiful walk. And I'm still being... Look at that tree, it almost looks like a goth, doesn't it, with his spiky hair there. And whiskers. Just about holding on. Yeah. God, look at that. You can see the hill fort from here. That up there. The hill fort. 